guys welcome back to my channel today's video is my favorite fives for the month of December but before I get into my favorites I do want to say happy new year and wish all of you guys a prosperous and amazing 2017 let's get into my favorite fives for the month of December because I didn't have a favorite fives for the month of November I have decided to combine them together and today I'm going to be doing my favorite 10 products or items for the month of December. Okay, so because this is sitting right here, I am going to start off with this book right here. It is called Real Moms, Making It Up As We Go. It's like, I feel like my face should be right here. It is such, like, this is me in this book. But I went to the Deseret Bookstore. I forgot what city they're in, but you can Google it. It's like 45 minutes away from me, but it was worth the drive. I picked up this and a couple of other books. And let me just read the back of it for you. It says, as moms, we improvise, we get along, we make things work. And we make a lot of things up as we go along because let's face it, no manual is ever going to cover all the bases a real mom needs to touch. But if laughter and perspective and a renewed energy to face the day are what you're after, if you too are a real mom, this book is for you. This is such a funny book. I have found myself over and over in this book. It's a quick read, so I'm reading this for the second time already. When you get a chance, check out this book. I like it, I like this book, I like it, I like so it. So moving on to bronzers and blushes. This is my go-to palette. It's called the Cheekathon by Benefit. I've had this for a while and I just keep forgetting to include it in my favorite. It comes with this cute little mirror and I love the little bronzer brush that it comes with. And then you get two bronzers and three blushes. This one up here, Dandelion, is a little too light for me. So I will mix it with Coralista. But in here we have Dandelion, Hula, Rocketeer, Dallas, and Coralista. This is a really nice palette. And I'm going to leave all the information down below. I feel like for the price that they were asking, this is worth it. I mean, you get Hula. This is the bronzer that everyone has been using. Sometimes I don't want to wear blush, but if I am going somewhere, like traveling with my family somewhere, I always for some reason reach for this because I feel like it adds a really nice glow to my face and adds color to back into my face. But this is what it looks like. It is really pretty and this is called Soleil by Milani. There goes my neighbor's dog again. Oh my gosh shoot my face off moving on to moisturizer i have completely finished this and i have enjoyed using this old henriksen sheer transformation moisturizer this i think it does um it doesn't smell like anything to me to me it smells like moisturizer like I don't know it just it doesn't smell like anything the only thing with this moisturizer is that it doesn't have SPF so you are going to need to add SPF to your um, your your face routine when you're using this this is good for day and night right I think yeah, you can apply this day and night. I only use this at night. This also has vitamin C, and you guys know vitamin C is good for anti-aging and brightening your skin. Now, let's talk about brushes. This one is dirty because I used it yesterday and today. This is my favorite, favorite brush to just swirl in here. Like, it takes up the perfect amount of my face when I'm trying to warm it up and then I take it up here. This brush is amazing. It is by Morphe and it is the M527 brush. Okay. So speaking of Morphe, I picked this up when I went into their store and it is the Korean Xander sponge and brush soap. I don't think they sell this on their website. I think you have to go in the store to actually get your hands on this. But this is my favorite, favorite soap to clean my eye brushes. I have like um, a little bowl that I put water in and so I will dip my eye brushes in there and then I will swirl it around in here and then I'll rinse it and then swirl it again in here and I swear to you like one and a half swirls my eye brush is clean on this side it's more um 
it's more textured on this side because if you have a brush that's like a little harder to clean you just flip this over and you use this side and then I'll flip it back and use this side and the cool thing is is that you can travel with this I mean it comes in its own little container I leave it in here and then if you travel you can just throw it in your makeup bag and take it with you so this is my definitely definitely my favorite okay because I haven't showed you guys any planner stuff in a long time I have fallen in love and I'm loving these create 365 sticker oops sticker sheets how cute is this it even comes with this little band that keeps all the sheets closed and together i am absolutely loving these i picked these up from michael's and i believe they come in five different themes how cute how cute are these so cute so i got this one and i also got this one this one has more themes like there's like summer fourth of july Valentine's Day, Christmas, fall, New Year's, and of course I use the Christmas ones already, but I am loving these. I need to go back and get the other three themes, but these are my favorite lately. These are all I've been using for my planners to decorate them besides washi tape. Let's talk about concealers. These are my favorite concealers. These are not only affordable guys, but these are just so nice and easy to use it comes with well the applicator looks like this which I can honestly do without this first one is in the color natural this second one is creamy beige so here goes this one I know they look the same but I promise you they're different Here goes a classic ivory and this is espresso so these are super affordable, pigmented. I am so in love with these, and I'm going to leave it all down below. I actually picked these up from a beauty supply store. Is this NYX Eyeshadow Base. I totally forgot about this, and there's a lot of product in here. But I love using this um, as a base on my eyelid before I apply um, any eyeshadow. And uh, I think I picked this up from CVS. Put it down, and then I will set it with my Laura Mercier translucent powder and then I'll go in with my eyeshadows but this is just really nice there it goes right there how nice is that and then it just blends really nice and then I'll set it with a translucent powder and then we are good to go I did a review on this I will leave the link down below this is the Propt by the sister company of Sigma um, I do have a discount code and affiliate links code down below so go ahead and check that out if you are interested but I love this only for my eye brushes not for the bigger face brushes because it's just um, I feel like I don't really get a good clean but with my eye brushes definitely so this for my eye brushes and this for the soap for my eye brushes okay guys so that wraps up my favorites for the month of December and November I'm also on Twitter Facebook Instagram and snapchat so I'm gonna leave all my social media links down below be sure to check them out Snapchat, I use a lot more just to let you guys know if I'm going to upload a video today or tomorrow or what's going on why I haven't uploaded something snapchat's kind of where it's at right Please now don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel i have a lot of things coming up and going on for 2017 that i cannot wait to share with you guys but i think that's about it thank you again so much for watching happy new year and i will see you guys in my next video